Welcome back. Day five of our 21 days of yoga. We've got 10 minutes together, so let's make the most of it. Let's do this. I have my block and strap. I don't know if I'm going to use it yet, so don't worry. If you don't have one today, that's okay. Spread all 10 toes and come into a forward fold at the top of your mat. Soft bend through the knees. And on your inhale, slide your hands up to the thighs. And exhale, fold forward. Inhale, come up. Exhale, fold. One more time, breathe and lengthen. Exhale, let everything go. Toe, heel your feet together. Take your right foot back, coming into pyramid pose. On your inhale, come up to the fingertips, looking to the top of the mat, and then exhale, fold forward. Let your head go and see the back of your mat. Breathe in, coming up. Exhale, down. One more, breathe in, lifting up. Exhale, fold forward. We will switch sides, making sure your feet are hip width apart, hip width apart. Send that right hip gently back, and let's start. Breathe in, exhale, fold. Inhale, flat back, eyes forward. Exhale, see the back of your mat. One more time, halfway lift, and let everything go. Bringing your feet together, come down all the way to the floor. Bringing your feet flat, lifting the hips up towards the ceiling. And take your forearms right beside you, pushing up a little bit more for your full bridge pose. Breathe in and exhale down. Breathe in up, press into the feet. Exhale down. Now stay, breathe in. Exhale, hug in the inner thighs and push up, bracing the belly. Inhale, come down. Exhale, engage, come up. Inhale, down. Bring the tailbone up, lifting the pelvis gently. Inhale, come down. Two more. Exhale, up. Inhale, down. One more. Exhale, up. And inhale, Bring it down. Hug the knees into your chest. Take your hands behind your knees and we're going to rock up and down the mat. Coming to our seats, balancing up and sweeping the feet behind us, moving into our tabletop. We tuck the toes. Now from here, stay, inhale, lengthen the spine. Brace the belly, exhale, come up. Cat pose. And as you inhale, roll the hips down, open the heart forward. Big inhale and exhale, round the back, push the floor away from you. Inhale, breathe in. Exhale, round. Two more, breathe in. And exhale. One more cycle of breath, breathing in. Exhale. Coming back to our neutral spine. Downward facing dog. Walk your hands all the way to the back of your mat. Open up the toes and sit nice and low using your fingertips to prop you up. And this is where if you have a block, you can walk the hands back to where it is and grab it, placing it underneath the hips. But if you don't want your block, you absolutely don't have to use it and kind of let gravity Take over the hips as you take your hands to touch. And if you want a little bit more, you can press into the fingertips or your fists. Widening up those hips. Lifting the heart as you breathe in. And exhale. Now bring your right fingertips down to the floor. Sweep the left arm up. Breathe in. And exhale, gently set the left hand down as you reach the right hand up. Breathe in. Exhale, come down. Two more, breathe in, exhale, last one, breathe in, and exhale. 
Come back forward, bring the toes in and lift the hips up nice and high. We're gonna bring the feet together as we roll all the way up. Sweep the arms up to the sky, folding forward. Let's practice that crow. We've been doing practices for five days, working up to this. So from the feet, walk the hands about two feet away from those toes. Bend the knees into the triceps and go for it. Fly forward. If you're still working on balancing, keeping one toe down or both toes, hug in the inner thighs, hold it here for three, two, one. Let's meet in our child's pose. Hands up to the top of the mat and then sink the hips nice and low, forehead down. Breathe in and breathe out. One breath in and sigh. You come up to the forearms, press your hands into the mat, lift your hips up nice and high for your dolphin. Breathe and lift the heels up. Exhale them down. We send the knees down, coming back into our tabletop. Let's sit into our seat, taking the feet out and then relaxing a little bit the shoulders and opening up those hips. Folding forward. Staying for a few breaths. And come all the way up. Take your right leg out, just focusing on the right leg. Walk your fingertips down both sides of the leg and fold forward. On your inhale, come up halfway. Exhale, fold. One more breathe in half up. And let it go. And coming all the way up, switching sides. Sweep the arms up, breathe in this time, and fold over that left leg. Pressing your fingertips into the floor, foot high up, those toes to the ceiling. Soften your leg. Breathe in. Breathe out. One more breath. And let it go. Come all the way up. Take your legs out in front of you, give them a little shake, and we'll roll down. Take your knees into the chest once you're on your back. Open up the feet now into a full straddle, kicking both legs out. Nice and wide, open up the knees. Stay for one breath in, and let it go. Of course, you can stay here as long as you want. You can even bend the knees and Create more of a happy baby. Oh, or take the feet down and just sway the knees from side to side. When you're ready, take your final rest. Of course, deciding on your own when you want to complete your practice. Feeling a little bit more, more fluid in the body. I'm going to come up to a seated position just to thank you for practicing with me. We just spent five, we just spent five days together. This is amazing. I can't wait for the next 16. <laughs> See you soon. Bye.